So after three months of no updates and people thinking that the game has been abandoned or it's dead, we finally got some something from Bandai. They finally spoke up. They released a brand new trailer previewing the next update for Super Dragon Ball Heroes World Mission. And they also updated the official website with the brand new cards. That's right, with the upcoming update, we're getting some brand new cards once again. That's the good news. The bad news is we're getting a whopping 17 cards. So just one more card more than the last update. Last update we got 16. It was all Broly cards or mostly Broly cards. And in this case, it's once again mostly Broly cards because over half the cards are from the movie. Uh, I will say though that Broly, Super Saiyan God, Vegeta hitting that Big Bang attack, that's a clean looking card. That's a good looking card in my opinion. It might be the best one of the bunch. That and the Super Saiyan God Goku that we're getting. I'll show you guys on the screen right here the new cards, all 17 of them. On one hand, it's great that we're getting, once again, free cards. You know, this is a free update. It's not paid DLC. But on the other hand, also, you know, we've waited three months and we're just getting 17 cards, which most of us will get within the first day or so, just like the last time. But thankfully, that's not all when it comes to the update, because according to Goresh on Twitter, he went ahead and said that the game will also be getting a 3x XP event for the campaign between August 10th and 18th for this free update. So anyways, in the comments section, let me know if you've been playing the game during this time where there wasn't any updates. Are you coming back because of this update, or have you been playing the entire time? Let me know in the comments section if you want to see the entire trailer and also the uh, official page for the updates. I'll link those in the description box. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, click the like button. I'm out. See ya.